This is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2022 Fall Carlisle Auction, checking out the Bill Miller Collection. Bill has been lightening his load, but he has collected some phenomenal vehicles. This is an 85 El Camino with the uh, 4.3 V6. Uh, really just a nice little car. Only 61000 on the clock. Beautiful addition. Brown interior. Look at that tonic. Bill loves original cars and something a little bit more unusual. He's got a couple of these Volkswagen diesel pickups coming up on the block. These were little workhorses. What killed them was the rust and they really rotted. This is an 82, uh, excuse me, 81. Of course, 1.6 diesel. Rare. Need a little bit of trivia on that. That's actually an American vehicle that was built over here in Pennsylvania. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Chrysler Royal Convertible. Was it 38? Yeah, 38. Just beautiful. Now, of course, Convertible has the roll up windows. Look at those vent wings. This is fantastic. Six cylinder, three speed, of course. Rumble seat. Oh my gosh. You see the steps going up. Only Chrysler could do. I always love details like this on Chrysler. Is that cool? Look at those tail lights. Neat. Again, 38 Chrysler Royal Convertible. This is not the top of the line Chrysler, but oh my gosh, you wouldn't. Today, I would never kick this out of my garage, that's for sure. This beautiful. I could definitely cruise in that. More trees. Look at this kind. Oh gosh. It's not a dragon. It's a uh, Manhattan 53. Of course, it's got the six cylinder. Which all the uh, Pisers have. What a cool car. Very unusual. Again, these were rust pockets, which were really something else. Uh, one family owned before the purchase with just 20,000 original miles. I want you to know something. This is as it was. Look at that beautiful interior. It has that bamboo and the dragon. Yeah, that's actually textured. It feels like bamboo. Automatic. These used hydromatics as some of the other car companies did because uh, it was that good of a transmission. Is that beautiful? What was the last time you saw it? Got a little Monte Carlo SS over here. This is what, 86. Just a fine little car. And it's got the 5 liter. 11,000 miles when it was added to Bill's collection. He likes the uh, low miles. Look at this Lincoln. Oof. Oof. 55. Yeah. This is gorgeous. And 
and of course being convertible. Now it's interesting is that manual windows on through. But when was the last time you've seen a 55 Lincoln convertible? Is that a striking car or what? Look at the bumper. That is so cool. Look at the way how the reverse lights just melt right around. What beautiful lines. They flow so graciously. And again, the biggest attraction to me is the convertible. Look at that. Gorgeous. When are you going to see another one? 55, of course, had the overhead bow. Here's one of my favorites. The Kaiser Dairy. This is a 55. I love the little kissy mouth grill. This is all fiberglass. The turn signals reflect the kissy kissy. That's the original six owner now. If I remember correctly, this is an F head. Let me see if I'm correct. Young doesn't work with the memory does. Yes, this is an F head six owner. In other words, just uh, one set of valves. It's also on an overhead, the other is still in the block as a flat head. See the difference? Overhead, and around the back, flat head, two in one. Yes, you can customize also. Of course, the most striking thing about the Kaiser Darren. This was done in conjunction with Kaiser. This is uh, sliding doors, it goes into the door pockets. Now you'll recognize the sliding doors from today's vans, new vans, internet dash. This is all original. That cool. Look at those seats. Now this, of course, has side curtains and button-up. I want to show you one thing. Check out the antenna. <laughs> early, early fiberglass cars. And in order to do the bumper, they made it in two pieces. So it's an expensive car, but it was still made on the cheap. Yes, those, by the way, are hubcaps. I'm just going to show you the dashboard. Got your switches underneath, including your ignition. Talk about ergonomics? Not. <laughs> wow. There's a sliding door mechanism. You can see it running along the track down there, latching over there. I like the hard boot. What's interesting is that the hinge for the trunk also hinges for the top. You know me, I love unusual, unusual cars. If you can't get any more unusual than a Kaiser Dare. That is sweet, and that is all original cars. A little 36 Ford pickup truck. Just an honest little truck. I mean, isn't that sweet? I'm gonna jump a little bit. Beautiful little Dia. 71. These have gotten so dear and ridiculous, you just don't find them. Because unlike the Volkswagen Beetle, all of the panels are actually leaded, welded and leaded in. Uh, it is remarkable. Uh, these were so custom built. Again by Carmen, uh, uh, designed by Gia, and of course powered by Volkswagen. Very straightforward, isn't it?
from the gear, we go to the Cadillac. This is good. I always love these reverse seat pillows. Is that cool? A hard top design. There's all the bills and stuff for it. Wow. Cool. Hang on a second. Just to show you some of the bills and stuff, the receipts. Great. Parts. Front, something, rebuild, all tires, $12. Here's your 58 color chart. Gorgeous. Something I wanted to show you here. Also, again, being all manual, which I always find fascinating on a car from Cadillac. See your vent coming through there? That's all ornamental until we get to the very back. So the back seat still has its own venting. This is gorgeous. Again, super low mileage on it. Had only 12,000 miles when I joined Bill Miller's collection. That's it. 58 was so overboard. Look at the detail of that grill. Each one of those are individual. Are they cast or piece? I think they're cast. I'll look it up and find out. So I can. No, they are in individual pieces there. Is that a car? We're going to demonstrate the gas cap on this car, too. Beautiful. Caddy fins have been prominent. Is that neat? I'll show you the tail. You can see the exhaust coming through. Let's take a look, see how we work the gas flap, shall we? This is really kind of funky. Let's go, we have an assistant here. Okay, show me the gas cap on this. Go ahead, push it down. That's now we're cool. gonna push this button. We have a reflector to open it up. And there's the gas right in there. Oh my gosh. I know GM did hide a gas cap on so many of these cars. Is amazing. When I was a kid, my father bought a 49. Uh huh. And every time you went to the gas station, if you weren't, of course, those days there, you had an attendant putting gas right. in Right, of course. So if you pulled up and you wanted to have fun, they went to put gas in the front where the gas was. Uh huh. Because you had to push the button and open up the tail light on the 49. But look at the 57 Chevy, you have to twist the uh, chrome piece to lift the tail light. I'm not familiar with that. Yeah. Oh, so many of these things are hilarious. You guys, thank you. All right, let's go from the 58 Cadillac. This has been painted. The door's been painted. Again, keeping in with Bill Miller collection, another 81 Volkswagen pickup, diesel pickup. Is that cool? This is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2021 Fall Carlisle Collector's Auction. Previewing the Bill Miller Collection. For more cool events like this, make sure you check your car show calendars. NortheastWheelsEvents.com, SoutheastWheelsEvents.com, UKWheelsEvents.com. And while you're there, post and share your events 
I'll see you at the show, and thanks for watching. Recommend us to your friends. Kissy, kissy.